I thought I was doing a pretty good job. If you're Patrick, then who's that? Hey guys, it's me, Flying Gorilla, from my new app on the App Store, Flying Gorilla. It's a free download, so I hope you, you check it out, and, and I hope... Yep, this is a real ad made by a real person that actually exists. Gentlemen, may I present to you the mobile ad. <laughs> I'm not that blue. It's getting worse and worse. Although it's the simplest. Next you have to treat it. How are you gonna I've gotta use my brains to play this. I I'm almost positive that nearly every person that currently lives in a developed country has played at least one mobile game in their lifetime. Hundreds of thousands of these things are shit out nearly every year by random Indonesian tech companies for the sole purpose of making a couple of extra bucks. The only problem that exists, however, is a... They all suck. <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? What are they doing? Oh my god, it's literally the Coldplay video. It's the Coldplay music video. <laughs> oh, some some child slavery worker definitely made this shit. <laughs> Damn! Oh my god! He's thick as shit! Yeah, don't, don't mind me, fellas. Just waltzing down the lean river. Alright, the lean river is turned into the, the fucking period blood river. That's nice. More edibles for me to ingest. Uh, five stars! Five stars submit! Uh, oh my god. Ah, oh, he is so attractive. Oh my god. No! No! Stop! No! No! Exit! 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 What the fuck is that? Oh, this is, this is a drug trip. Oh, wait, but he's bugging off the fucking park. Holy shit! <laughs> it's fucking cum monkey! No! 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 Fuck you! Fuck you! Get the fuck out! Fuck that shit! The entire purpose of mobile games is to try and make your game as appealing to as many people as possible. It doesn't matter how garbage the actual game is, the purpose of mobile game developers is to grab the attention of everyone who plays their games. And that's it. This is where the mobile ads come into play with game developers such as Voodoo trying to grab the attention of any fetus that clicks on a YouTube video. And let me tell you, these ads are technological hemorrhoids. With all that being said, enjoy some of the worst shit you will ever lay eyes on. So right off the bat, we've already got some abysmal shit, where the entire purpose of the game is to hold your finger down and kill a bunch of Mexican immigrants. I love at the end, the character just flexes his muscles like, Yeah guys, I annihilated an entire family of immigrants with my murderous metal fins. It was either gonna be me or the metal cages, guys. Come on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so there's a lot to unfold here, but let's start off with the fact that Sid from Toy Story has a r radioactive green piss. There are so many levels to this shit, such as the fact that this is literally the entire plot for the fucking Ants movie from like 2000. Also, how big are these fucking ants? And how are they able to create hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of property damage? What else can these things fucking do? Create a cure for cancer? <laughs> Go 
cover your fucking eyes, kids! I can barely even watch this shit! Okay, let's address the obvious fact of stupidity for this advertisement. This tactic is intentional, and you see it nearly all the time, where people will purposely act like idiots when playing the game in order to make their game appear easy to play. This, however, is taking it like a thousand steps in the opposite direction. We also talk about what the fuck you did with a hand mixer? If anything, that shit's a torture method. I don't know where the hell you got that from. I also can't get over the fact that you can't use your hands to pull her out. Your, uh, your options are scissors, scissors, olive oil, a hand mixer, and a cheese grater. I finally found the game. Ebony the King's Return. That's right, guys. That's the exact game you always see in those ads. Yeah. I've seen enough of their videos today. I'm gonna play it. To be honest, I've gotta use my brains to play this. Oh, I failed again. Look, now I'm stuck on this level. Oh my god, I lost my treasure. Time to test your brain. Download now and give it a try. Is it really that crucial for you to add a voice actor? For an actor? Like, it's giving me an aneurysm for how horrible this synchronization is. N now that I think of it, does this dude even work for this game? Or did they just rip this off from another game developer and just dub the game over the original audio? I've gotta use my brains to play this. What fucking brain? You're a mobile ad developer! Sexual assault so funny and quirky, guys. Fuck you and this shitty ad. You don't deserve any more screen time. <laughs> Can anyone please explain to me how this dude is using his crotch as a scope? And he's using his fucking sperm as ammo! Like, am I the only one smoking crack here? How is he doing that? The, de the, de the, de the detail of making two pregnant women turn into a man was also just an exceptional game design choice. This level of ingenuity hasn't been seen in a mobile ad universe thus far. So can we appreciate spicing things up for the introduction of trans people? One of the most important factors in advertising any mobile ad is the idea that sex sells. And speak of the devil. Well, it looks like we got Aunt Fanny from the Robots movie making a comeback in the mobile ad universe with this monstrosity. The first time I saw this, I assumed somebody's ball sack was hanging on the screen, but it wasn't much of an improvement when I found out that was somebody's dump truck. Kim Kardashian could make a feature film on her life story, and this fucking ad would be in the end credits. All right, okay. Uh, that's it for the ads. I I, I don't want to live on a planet where shit like this exists. I, I'm seriously gonna lose it if I. You gotta be kidding me.
You know, you know what? That was game of the year.